Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button, also subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang gang, notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the Super Chats, channel donations, the Venmo, and the Patreon family we work in. Now, this is just a follow-up video to a video I already made. I told you guys that the WBO mandated and ordered a fight between their champion, Billy Joe Saunders and David Lemieux. They have 30 days from the date it was ordered to come to an agreement. If they cannot with the two camps, then they go to a purse bid and they do an auction style bid for the rights to the fight. Now, the camps are already in talks trying to get this worked out. They want David Lemieux to come back in December. They're targeting December 16th for the date. They want to fight Billy Joe Saunders. Billy Joe Saunders has been approved by HBO for David Lemieux. So meaning there's they want to see David Lemieux. They have the budget and, and they want to have him back on the network. But there's only a few names that he could fight that they will approve. You know what I'm saying? Basically, they want a good fight. It can't be Miguel Cotto, who was linked to David Lemieux at one point. Cotto has decided to fight a welterweight, Saddam Ali. So maybe they can get this fight done with Billy Joe Saunders. Now, one of the interesting things is Billy Joe Saunders being the champion, they're talking about bringing him to Canada, which is David Lemieux's home. That's his stomping ground. So I thought that was pretty interesting that the champion would be the one traveling. So that's the thing. It just has to make sense for all parties involved. Obviously, Billy Joe Saunders, he's been, I would say, kind of fickle, especially like with the Golovkin fights and stuff. I want a couple things me way and all that. So I'm sure he's going to want a pretty penny to travel to David Lemieux's backyard to fight him. But they're still early in the negotiation process, but it sounds like the talks are advancing. I hope they get this done. 2017 has been lit. This would be a great middleweight fight. And the winner of it could maybe fight Canelo versus Triple G winner if they rematch each other. You know what I mean? Because this will, whoever has, if they do fight Billy Joe Saunders and David Lemieux, whoever wins will have the WBO belt, which will be the missing link to Undisputed at middleweight, right? Danny Jacobs also has an upcoming fight with Luis Cuba Adias. I would love to see the winner of that fight fight against the winner of David Lemieux versus Billy Joe Saunders. I think Danny Jacobs, if he beats Cuba Adias, vice versa, they definitely deserve a title shot. I thought Jacobs did very good versus Golovkin. In fact, I thought he beat him. I was at the fight live, I covered it as media. So a lot of different ways you can twist it. And like I said, Jacobs did this new deal with HBO, so he has no problem fighting on the network. And you also have Jamal Charlo, who, who's a beast, and maybe they can get an Al Heyman guy over there to fight the winner of Billy Joe Saunders, David Lemieux. So I'm really liking the middleweight division currently. I think more so than the last four years, you see a lot of emerging players and a lot of momentum. So hopefully they get this Billy Joe Saunders, David Lemieux fight to help sort it out, the who's who of the division, and, and put up a great fight. I think this will be Billy Joe Saunders' biggest test in a, in a while. And no disrespect to Willie Monroe Jr., but he didn't look the same in his fight. But beyond that, he, he's not a big puncher. David Lemieux is. So anytime you deal with the puncher and David Lemieux, has, he's on a win streak, you, you got to be cautious. You got to be on your P's and Q's. If Billy Joe Saunders had a performance like when he fought that Wolverine dude, Berserker Barrage, jump out, jump out, right? That's not going to work with, with the puncher. The quality of, of David Lemieux so it's a good fight David Lemieux there to be outboxed obviously Billy Joe Saunders will probably try to outbox him like Golovkin was doing utilize the jab and and Billy Joe Saunders will probably use some movement so I think all in all is a good fight they're trying to get it done for December 16th I will keep you guys posted just to follow a video to an ego rumor mail video drop your thoughts in the comment section make sure you smash the like button as always hate comment and subscribe
Till next video is Ego signing off. So if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel, you can show your appreciation by going to the PayPal donate button or the YouTube support button. And you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video. Much more to come. Thank you guys for your support. Boxing Ego, the future of boxing. Yeah.